Hello, everybody. I am Dr. Stephen Gilligan. I am here in my home in San Diego, California. And I want to invite you to our annual uh, Generative Trance Summer Intensive here in San Diego in July, July 1st through 19th. And uh, it is, I think everybody considers it to be the premier training event that I do every year. It's had a long tradition of a number of decades. And we get together in this beautiful hotel, very small, uh, in the beautiful summer weather of San Diego. We've got people coming from all over the world. I think last time we had 22 different cultures. And we spend this intensive time seriously, playfully, professionally, personally, really getting this deep connection to what generative trance can be for you and for the people in your life. So it's a three week program. You can come one, two or three weeks. The first week, we really try to develop this experiential sense of what is generative trance because it's very, very different from traditional hypnosis. But we see it more of a, like this high performance creative state where you're connected to the best of who you are, you're connected to the world, you can do this amazing work. So that's what we focus on in the first week is what's a generative trance, how you can use it creatively. The second week builds on that. And we look at how creativity, which we consider to be the sort of the, the central core of, of human being, how creativity is organized around needs and these universal needs like warmth, connection, uh, safety, freedom, et cetera and how at the heart of those core needs are, are the basic psychological patterns by which we create our reality. We see that if these expression of these needs come out in negative ways, you develop symptoms and problems and shadow places, but we also see how a generative trance can go really deeply, safely inside of consciousness connect to those needs and bring them in a very, very positive way into how people are experiencing and expressing their life. This is a new part of the work. I'm really excited about it. I think you really enjoy it. And then the third week, what we're looking at is this fact, research fact that no matter what your method is, about a third of the time it doesn't work. And so, you're sort of challenged with this place. What do you do when you're following a technique conscientiously, but nothing is working? Generative trance gives you a great way to be able to have a creative response in terms of really going into this deep, relational, connected trance state to be able to sense the really subtle things that are going on in a person's experience, many of them hidden to the sort of upper level cognitive social self and how to safely tune into those and join with those like music and then be able to invite them and welcome and then see how this incredible healing, incredible creative work unfolds from being able to do that. So we call that when, when the technique fails. And uh, uh, it, it really, to me, is, is the, the main thing I was inspired by my mentor, Milton Erickson. So I really hope that I can share that with you and you can use that in these really generative ways. So that's a lot, right? So generative trance, how to use it creatively, uh, tap into the, the universal core of how people are responding and experiencing human needs and then use it in the places where uh, your conscious mind can't go or your technique doesn't work so that's the package to say it's it's a great time um, i i look forward to it every year so we hope to see you there welcome